Welcome to my channel everyone. This is a Turkish chocolate cake dessert which uses sour cream, cream cheese and a few basic kitchen ingredients to make the ultimate dessert that is not too sweet but still delicious on the palate. This takes one hour to prepare and serves eight people so let's get started. In a bowl add in 30 grams of cocoa powder then add in one teaspoon of baking powder and also add in 80 grams of all-purpose cake flour. Mix this all together and then leave aside. In a separate bowl, add in three eggs, 180 grams of granulated sugar, 50 ml of full cream milk, and 50 ml of sunflower oil. Beat this until it changes to a light pale color. Once this mixture is a pale color, add in your cocoa powder mixture and beat this. And then when you're ready, pour this into a casserole about 15 by 20 centimeters in size and bake at 170 degrees Celsius for 30 to 35 minutes. While that is baking, in a pot add in 200 ml of full cream milk, 40 grams of cocoa powder, and 50 grams of granulated sugar. Mix this all together and cook on low heat until the sauce thickens. Once it has thickened, add in 20 grams of unsalted butter and allow this to melt. Then in a food processor or using a handheld beater, you can add in 300 grams of sour cream. And then to this, add in 100 ml of smooth cottage cheese. Also add in 5 tablespoons of icing sugar or powdered sugar and 1 tablespoon of cocoa powder and then beat this until it is all mixed together. Once the cake layer has been made, poke in holes and add in 50 ml of full cream milk. This actually softens the cake. And then to layer, add in your cream cheese mix. And then top this off with your cocoa syrup that we made over the stove and spread this out evenly as well. Decorate as desired. I usually prefer using fresh strawberries. So I'm going to be putting in some fresh strawberries and I'm also going to be topping this with some crushed coconut biscuits. And your chocolate cake dessert. Turkish chocolate cake dessert is now ready to be served. And look at how amazing this is. It actually tastes even better. So try it out and let me know in the comment section below. Enjoy and until the next vlog, happy baking!